Welcome to a third video on the properties of perpendicular lines. In this video we'll prove the theorem that states if two exterior sides of two adjacent acute angles are perpendicular, then the angles are complementary. Again, let's start by defining perpendicular lines. Perpendicular lines are two lines that intersect and form right angles as we see here. Now let's take a closer look at the theorem that we're going to prove. If the two exterior sides of two adjacent acute angles are perpendicular, then the angles are complementary. So these two black rays, BD and BA, would be the exterior sides of the adjacent angles ABC and angle CBD. So given that ray BA is perpendicular to ray BD, we want to prove that angle ABC, this angle here, and angle CBD, this angle here, are complementary. So let's talk about our plan before we start. We know if these two rays are perpendicular, then angle ABD, this large angle here, would have to be a right angle and therefore measures 90 degrees. And it's also true that if we sum these two acute angles, it must equal the measure of angle ABD. So if we know angle ABD measures 90 degrees, then the sum of these two acute angles must also measure 90 degrees and therefore they'll be complementary. So let's see if we can write this out. Step one will be the given. Ray BA is perpendicular to ray BD. That's given. So if these two rays are perpendicular, angle ABD must be a right angle. And the reason for this would be by definition of perpendicular lines. So this tells us that the measure of angle ABD equals 90 degrees, and this is by definition of a right angle. We also know that the measure of angle ABD must equal the measure of angle ABC. Plus the measure of angle CBD. This is by the angle addition postulate. Now taking a look at step three and step four, we can perform substitution. We can replace the measure of angle ABD with 90 degrees, which is what we want because if the sum of the measures of these two angles is 90 degrees, they must be complementary by definition of complementary angles. So step five, by using substitution, we can say 90 degrees is equal to measure of angle ABC plus the measure of angle C BD. Now if we wanted to, we could flip this equation around by the symmetric property, but there's no real need to. Again, for this step, we use the substitution property. Again, for step six, we know the sum of these measures is 90 degrees, and therefore angle ABC and angle CBD are complementary. And this is by definition of complementary angles. Oh, I hope you found this example helpful.